Good morning, good morning. What's going on with everybody, man? Back at y'all with another one. All right, man. Uh, before I get into this video, let me send my respects out to Neil Tizad for covering about this topic that I'm about to get into and discuss. I don't know if you saw that video. It was about urban slang and... Yeah, it was about urban slang and I forgot the rest of it, but it was a good video and then, you know, and I'm gonna be real. I even sent a good comment on that video too as well. He was uh, he was 100% about what he was saying. Nothing that the 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 words that came out of that man's mouth was 100% on point. I can tell you that right now, and it's true. Especially what goes on in Long Beach, man. It's a it's a motherfucker, and especially from the dumb, stupid comments I be reading on other people's videos and shit when I be when I be through there and everything, and I be laughing because um my thing is the people the stuff that people put on. That be that they be commenting the comments that they put. I know damn well they ain't gonna say that shit in real life. They ain't gonna say that toe to toe to the uh, creator of the video. Hell no, they ain't gonna do it. But anyway, uh, let me get into it right quick, man. You know what? Yeah, racism is a big ass factor. It's a big issue. Nobody never wants to talk about it. Nobody never wants to cover that that type of subject. What it is. And I know it. Oh, my bad about that. And I know it for a fact. Um, it's an uncomfortable topic. Trust me. Even to me, it's, it's kind of uncomfortable. You know what I mean? It's uncomfortable. I can say it. I'm being real. You know? And you ain't gonna get nothing but the truth on my damn channel. You know that. It's going. I'm gonna say it like it is. Yes, racism, race, racial discussion is a very uncomfortable topic. Now, the thing that I don't like, and I do agree on what i saw in this video is true you know there's fools out here who be saying shit like this saying that all oh, for an example and i'm gonna go from both sides and i'm gonna speak from both perspectives you know you know no disrespect to nobody um and shout out to everybody you know what i mean even though my own kind don't like me for shit for whatever reason it may be and i'm being real they can't stand me because you know what let me say like this not to get off topic or whatever i go to the gym now you know what I mean? And I do my workout routine. Um, I use the elliptical machine. I do cardio first. Every time when I go there, I do cardio first. Then sometimes I go over there where my girl be at. We, we be hitting the treadmill together for a little bit. And then after that, um, I go lift weights. I go pretty much after that, I'm done with cardio. I go, I start going lifting weights and everything, hitting those, hitting those weights. Um, you know what I mean? No pain, no gain, as they say, you know? For real, though. I do be working out, and I am exercising five days a week. It varies from week to week, depending on how busy I am. But I do go five days a week, like this week, on um, Wednesday through Thursday. But anyway, that's for a whole other video and a whole other day. All right. What I notice when I go to the freaking gym and shit is that my own kind, they try to start fucking shit with me for no fucking reason. I should be minding my business, sweaty as hell. And these motherfuckers just be staring at me like, what? And I'd be like this. To myself, I'm thinking like, if you got a problem with me, say something. Let's go out in the parking lot. Let's go handle it. You know, not inside the gym and, and disrupt the people from from their workout routine or, you know, whatever they do up in the damn gym. And, I'm, and you know, and I'm going to keep it real. Majority of those motherfuckers who be going to the goddamn gym, they only go to go look at some big, they'll go look at a big bouncing ass. I'm just keeping it real. I'm saying like it is. Oh well, you're gonna get mad and get in your feelings. So what? It's true. I don't know how many numerous of times I caught dudes just in a in a forgaze. Like, <laughs> I'm serious though. I'm not being funny right now. I'm serious. I be seeing this shit. And my mindset. When Sorry, I y'all. My gym bad, is, man. My phone had to start ringing and shit and going off, so I cut the video. But anyway, man. Like I was saying, my mindset when I go to the gym and shit is uh pretty much. You know, fuck everybody that's up in there, and I do me, and I work out how the way I work out. And I push myself to the limit, and I'm to the point to where my whole shirt be wet, and damn near literally my sweatpants be wet. So, I be up there hauling ass at the gym, man. For real though, just how the way I work is how the way I work, I put in work at the gym too. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, but anyway, you know, back to the subject and everything. If this video is long, I'm sorry, but 
you know what I mean? If you get bored, you, if you don't watch it the whole time, it's, it's cool though. I ain't tripping. It's all right. Or if you want to skip and cut, get to the good spots, it's cool. All right. All right. Um. All right. Let me get into this about this this racial this racial stuff, man. You know what? I'm not a fan of it, and it's true. I don't like that. It's go for both sides. It goes from the blacks to the to the goes from the blacks to the browns, man. This is shit that I I can't stand with the with, with these uh with these fucking Morenos be fucking doing this shit. They be like, man, they be like, man, fuck these Mexicans. They be like, fuck these wetbacks. They be saying all this this dumb nonsense shit when they got their homeboys who is Hispanic, obviously, or they could be white too. You know what I mean? They got some Hispanics. They got some of my white boys who's down with the who who who's down who's down with the blacks. I see it all the time, especially in Long Beach. They got Mex they got Crips that are Mexicans. They got they got uh they got wedos that, that are that that are that are Crips as well too. I see it I see it all the time, you know. And and um and if that's what they want to do, that's what if that's what they want to do is that's what they want to join. Go ahead, cool. I ain't got nothing against it. I don't like the racial parts when they saying racially derogatory things against that other person's ethnicity and that's supposed to be your friend quote unquote or your fucking camarada what the fuck it's just stupid to me and then um you know you got the uh, you got you got the hispanics talking about the talking about blacks and stuff saying that uh especially in lomis man they got that fuck niggers bullshit and uh fuck mayates and all of that and that black that black people are dirty and everything you know what and let me clarify something about that shit about black people being fucking dirty let me say this right quick you know what my family is not fucking dirty i come from a fucking good productive ass family where i was raised right my mom ain't perfect but i was raised goddamn right i let me say this right quick i know how to cook clean wash my own goddamn drawers Wash my clothes. Uh, everything. Iron my clothes. I know how to do it all. They taught me this stuff. They taught me these things when I was younger and I was a little boy. You know what I'm. You know what I'm saying. So my family ain't fucking dirty. You see my grandmother's house. That shit is clean and she's on top of that shit and she don't like that filthy that filthy ass shit. So you know. So it's just it's just and this goes for both sides. You know. Um, ninety percent of my homeboys are Mexicans. Um, I'm not a racist. I ain't got nothing against them. Nothing, nothing but love and respect to them and everything. You know, 90% of my homeboys are Mexicans, and and 90% of them, their family, their household is clean and very well organized from the outside to the inside. Real shit. So all Mexicans are not dirty neither. I'm speaking from both sides. You know what I mean? So I just hate hearing shit like that, and then and. I hate hearing shit like that from both sides, and it's like, y'all, y'all homies is black, y'all homies is a uh, Mexican, Salvadorian, some type of Hispanic descent. So it's like, how can y'all be saying stuff like that? Is that fake or what? Y'all tell me. Now you know. Now you got the real ones who will say like it is. Be like, you know what I mean? Um, I don't like blacks for whatever reason. You know, whatever the reason may be. You know what I mean? Like, cool. See, I respect that. If somebody's just upfront and honest about. You know, why they dislike this race, why they dislike this ethnicity, uh, why, you know what I mean, why, why, you know what I'm saying? You know, uh, why, why I like, why I don't like, what I don't like about it or why I don't agree on. See, really what I feel it is, it's just a disagreement about both eth ethnicities, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be real with y'all from my experiences. Um, oh shit. From my experiences, you know, um, Hispanics run a little bit differently. You know, they more under, they more about the traditional way of going on things. You know, and I can say this from from experience. Trust me. Uh, the mother of my child is Hispanic, so I know I know what it is already. You know, I know the I know what the deal is already. You know what I'm saying? She got to respect that at the end of the day. This don't matter if you're with a, uh, if you're with a Mexicana or if you got or if you got friends that is Hispanic. You know what I'm saying? If they invite you to go to their house or whatever, you got to respect their. You gotta respect their rules and regulations and how the way to get down, you know? You gotta respect it. Same thing goes... It's vice versa, you know what I mean? You gotta respect their culture at the end of the damn day, you know? You know what I'm saying? So, I just hope that... You no, know, this is an eye-opener, you know? This doesn't need to be discussed more. And like I said, man... 
Um, I get along on both sides, you know what I mean? But like I said, 90% of my homeboys are Hispanic. Don't know why, it just happened. Grew up with them, went to school with them, had classes with them, all the way all the way to high school and shit, you know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, I can't discuss nothing else further because, yeah, I'm in a good space right now. <laughs> You know what I mean? I'm a free man, but uh, yeah, you know what I mean? I love being free. But um, yeah, man. And, and it's sad but true. Most of, me, most of my own kind does not like me for whatever reason other than my family members. Now, my family members, they understand, they respect me where I'm coming from, and they respect me for what I'm about because they know I'm not that individual, and I was not raised like that, man. Real talk, though. I was not raised like that. And uh, that's why I'm always, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm only shouting out to the Spanish because, you know what I mean? I feel they, that, I feel honestly, they don't get the, the respect that they deserve, you know? I'm just being real, you know? And uh, for the uh, blacks, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't agree how, I don't agree, I don't agree. What I don't agree about is how, is how it is, how it is nowadays with, with my own kind and everything, you know what I mean? Like, oh, you gotta go buy a foreign car. You gotta go spend all your money on dumb shit jewelry and these fancy ass thousand dollar ass clothing and shit just to prove something to fucking people you know what i'm a, I, I say like this all the time man i drive a 99 expedition and my other cars in the shop i ain't got no foreign vehicle because i got a good mechanical background foreign vehicles are pieces of shits mercedes and bmws those are always stranded on the side of the road every time i'm out here on the road so why would i go spend all my money on a luxury car and just to have homies or fake ass friends or fake ass associates you, you see what I'm saying? I'm just different. It is what it is, and I'm going to continue to be myself. And either you respect it or you don't like it. It is what it is, man. But um, other than that, till then on the next video, I'm out of here.